Hey guys, Shane Sarns with DroidMotorX.com. I'm going to show you real quickly my favorite feature of the Omni ROM. It is easily the Omni switch. The way that you enable it on the Omni ROM is you would go into your app drawer, you would choose Omni switch, and turn it on. Of course, you can choose to have it to start on boot. There are a few settings here you can choose to animate or not. So if you don't animate, when you pull it out, there is no animation that happens there, which makes things a little quicker but I kind of like the animation. And you can choose the icon sizes. You can choose the opacity. So the higher the percentage, the darker the screen uh, in the background there, and the lower the percentage, the lighter the screen. You can choose the horizontal gravity, so where you grab from to open the Omni switch. You can choose to display the app name. You can configure the buttons. You can change the color and the opacity of the button itself. If you have no opacity at all, you really can't see the button at all, and it's like you're not even running it, and you would just be able to grab it from there. Of course, the more opacity that you have, the clearer that button is. Turn the quick switcher on. Okay, so you're able to manage your favorites. These would show up, uh, if you click the little arrow, there are your favorites. The way you would add these is just click Manage Favorites and Add, and then check the ones that you want to show up. So if you have no reasons, you can just go to your favorites and open those up. So the one thing that I really love about the Omni Switch is the fact that it works from any screen on your device. So before uh, this on the Omni ROM, if you're just running the regular AOSP ROM, you'd have to go to the Recents button and you'd have to scroll through a menu of Recent Applications. And if you had no Recents, you would not be able to multitask at all. Uh, with the Omni Switch, you're able to multitask from any screen on the device. So if you go into an application, you'll be able to pull up the Omni Switch and uh, quickly jump to another application. It just makes getting around in your phone super easy and super quick. So I'll just show you real quickly how it works. We'll open it up. And I'll just go to the Chrome browser. Open it back up and go to YouTube. Open it back up and go to Settings. Open it back up we can go Home. Open it back up, we'll open the app drawer, and then choose any of our applications and navigate there from the switch. And then we can go and erase our recents if we want to. And you guys just see how easy it is to navigate uh, through different applications with the Omni Switch. So guys, that about wraps it up for the Omni Switch quick review. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at DroidMotorX.com. You can find more of me at DroidMotorX.com. I'll have the latest in Android and tech news. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.